Hello, beautiful souls. I'm hearing acting against or outside of his true nature. So in some cases, it may be very confusing to the divine feminine here, because you might be seeing or you've seen this masculine in real time, acting in ways that are very opposite to his true soul essence and nature. It's like there's this very fresh energy around you, but it's requiring you to leave that heavy energy, which again, I feel could be a particular emotional or mental pattern, or it might be a thing or connection in your life. But for most, I'm getting this is very internal, something that has to be addressed and released. With happy family upright, I am seeing that this could be around your feeling of worthiness, of having connections in your life that are truly happy and harmonious, that really bring you a feeling of peace and harmony. Maybe there was some internal pattern that was blocking you in the past from really manifesting the support that you needed. I'm getting that something may have been blocking your receptive energy when it came to receiving this harmonious support physically in 3D from people around you. With the community card in the reverse position, I'm hearing, I've been alone most of my life. Don't meander aimlessly among the herb sellers and potion vendors. Go directly to the shop that sells nothing but sweets. Don't sit by waiting by every boiling pot to have your plate filled. Not every boiling pot is cooking what you want. Not every sugar cane is filled with sugar. Not every dawn has an up. Not every eye has vision. Not every sea contains pearls. Rumi and the guidebook also says, On the path of love, there is not so much wrong and right in the moral sense, so much as what is wrong or right for you. The mind cannot help so much here. Only the heart can speak such truths. The mind may reject it, recoil, analyze, and find all the reasons why this simple truth, the right choice of the heart, cannot possibly work and only lead to pain. Let me know how you've been feeling this week. I really love the comment section as a way for us to engage with each other and build a sense of mutually supportive community, especially since many of us are in places or locations where we might feel very alone at times. So I really feel that it's so beautiful we can create this sense of community here virtually together to support each other along this journey. So I am shuffling the cards, really clearing out the energy here, and I'm just going to start the reading in a very open-ended way and see what comes through. Of course, your energy and intentions are powerfully co-creating this reading as well, regardless of when or where you are tuning in from. And I always recommend that you stay in touch with your own intuition during the readings and only take messages that feel good for you and connect with you in an intuitive way. With the heart chakra upright, I'm hearing, go where your heart feels safe to be open, feel safe to be soft. Go where you feel like you can be the full expression of the emotions flooding through you and where you can feel safe and protected and held in all of that. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.